Hey everyone, welcome back to 365 Ninja. Today I want to go through some of the integrations between Dropbox and Office 365. And at the time I'm filming this, there was just an announcement about editing Office 365 files from Dropbox. So this is basically going to be a live demo. We don't usually do this on 365 Ninja, but unscripted, I'm just going to kind of walk through and see what we can find out. So I have uploaded this Ninjas document to my Dropbox, and I'm going to just click on it and see what happens. Now you can see my document opened. Let's see if I click open. Microsoft Office Online would like access, so let me allow access. Ah, cool. So you can see that I'm still actually in Dropbox, but I have the very familiar Word Online experience here. Now if I click Home, I'm going to stay in Dropbox. So that could be really handy if you are on a computer where you don't have, say, your Office 2013 applications. You don't actually have to leave Dropbox to work with Office Online. So I did want to see if there's anything new in Word Online or any of my Office Online apps. So let me go to my Word Online and I get a message here. I can open and edit my documents and save them back to Dropbox if I add my Dropbox account. So let me do that. And since I'm already signed into Dropbox, it looks like it just automatically added my account. Let's see. There's my Ninjas doc. So cool. It looks like this is a pretty seamless integration. And if you use both Dropbox and Office 365, this is definitely something that you'll want to check out. If you have any feedback or tips about this Dropbox Office 365 integration, please let me know. Go to 365ninja.com and you can contact us there or on any social channel. Thanks.